Hello, YouTube. Woody Butter here, and we are back in Summer Night Swordcraft Story. As uh, still in the tutorial. Oh, hello. Oh, our oh, voices. Um, yo, Butter. <laughs> I'm sorry if these are wrong, but you know. Oh, Master, I was just about to go see you. The folks from Central Tower have arrived. Oh, sorry. Ah, oh, sorry. I've got to get back into the mindset. <laughs> the folks from Central Tower have arrived. Behave yourself. Hello, hello. Greetings, Butter. I have a delivery for you. Here is your labyrinth key. Oh, okay, one. One, there are several. Show this key to the guard in the first floor of the central tower and you can enter the labyrinth. I must get going. Excuse me now. Do I get to make a sword first, though? So this is the labyrinth key. That labyrinth under the central tower is a treasure mine for craft knights. If you're going to be a skilled craft knight, you've got to find your own materials. Oh no, there's going to be monsters, isn't there? That's all i got to say. Oh. But I heard that there are tons of summon creatures and stray summons protecting the Holy Spirit Parista from evil in the labyrinth. Isn't that right? I'm a bit scared. A skilled craft knight needs to be a master at wielding weapons as well as making them. you got to be able to handle 100 or 200 strays by yourself. You've got to be kidding. You're going to be a craft lord guardian of the Holy Spirit Parista, right? By the way, if you ever end up becoming a craft lord, you'll be going to the Shrine of Parista every month, located in the depths of the labyrinth. If you can't make it to the Holy Spirit, you'd be a sh you'd be shamed as a craft lord. You would, you, yeah. I guess you're right, Master. Anyway, the battle's already begun. Get with it. Get with it. <laughs> All right, let's begin. I, Master Bron, will teach you the technique of crafting weapons. Um. Why did you move close to me? I don't want... Oh, okay. The very first weapon that you're going to craft is this. A uh, new technique. I'm going to craft a new technique blade. Wow! It's a new technique! I'm nervous. <laughs> this will be... <laughs> this will be my very first craft. Be, be gentle. <laughs> don't be so nervous. You've got Bob Reborn to assist you. Oh, this is getting a bit dirty. Oh, um, <laughs> I've been told that... Cutie, or Cutty, whatever his name is, her, I don't know, has to be more, and I quote, kawaii desu desu. <laughs> I am not mocking, it's, it's everywhere. So, um, I'm not really used to cutifying things, but cutie. <clears throat> That's, that was terrible. I'll try again later. Um, now let's see if you remember the basics of making a weapon. I don't remember a thing. <laughs> I don't remember a thing. Gah! What have you been listening to? Oh, you know, a bit of a uh, bit of pop, a bit of chameleon circuit. I'm like, yeah, it's truck is truck's nice. You know. Ugh! Right. I'll teach you this once more, and don't forget this time. Look, I can't remember how to make a sword, despite being your apprentice for what seems like months. So, I mean, I'm not really cut out to be a craft knight. Can I like live in an old people's home with my Freakish, punching pet. Mm -mm. Yes, master. First, collect items that can be used as weapon materials. Next, heat and smelt the items using the forge and separate them into four kinds of mineral ores. Uh, which one's the forge again? What the? Ooh, look, this is it. This is the forge. This big thing you've been staring at every day. <laughs> yes, uh, I get it. Uh, he's really mad. I better watch what I say. Getting back to the subject. Then, use the right combination of ores for each weapon technique and combine them in the forge. Smite them all into shape with your hammer to complete it. You got that? Yes, I'll give it a shot, Master. First things first, go get yourself some materials. From where? Okay. Go buy some iron ore at the item shop this time. Huh? Ar aren't we supposed to collect materials in the labyrinth? Aye, that's correct. But were you gonna head in there without any weapons? Well, I mean, I've got a punching thing... <laughs> thing with me, and probably throw it at them. Or leave it for bait and just run. <laughs> that would be very tough. So you gotta make a weapon first. The biggest reason I told you to buy them is because... 
Oh, you know is on sale today. <clears throat> I see. The price is ten boam for each. Creepy grin. <laughs> oh, that's. I don't. Ooh, I don't like his face. That's cheap. Is this an advert now? Are we making an advert for Iron Ore? Here's some cash. Now run off and buy as much as you can. This is an advert. We're literally hosting an advert for. Oh, he's angry again. Never mind. There'll be hordes of bargain hunters for the sale. Hurry up and get yourself over there now. Yes, master. Three hundred boams, I think. It's like moam, but much less edible. Uh, <laughs> uh, right. Shops. Do we know where the shops are? I can. Oh my god, I can run. Oh my god, it's like a whole new game. Where are the shops? Dude, dude with the amazing glasses. Where are you? Why? Why do you have two brothers on the street? Anyway, Wistan is famous for its craftsmanship, especially in weapon craft. Some people refer to it as the City of Swords. Okay. Uh. It didn't help me. In the labyrinth, you'll find various items that can be turned into weapon materials. But though I don't care about you. Tell me where the market is. You know something. Every year, Wistan sinks it just a tiny bit into the sea. <laughs> the reason why the city is always under construction above the third floor is so that we'll be ready to migrate to higher ground when the lower floors sink. Oh, cheer up. Uh, uh, you, where is the market? Do you know what masters? I don't care. I want a market. Why? Why am I? I'm like 10. Am I seriously going to buy something from the... Okay, this is a pub. And they just let me in at the age of, what, 10? Okay. Uh, mm. To their credit, they were serving me water, so I guess it's not all bad. <laughs> oh, still a bit weird. Okay. Um, we need to find a shop that isn't a pub. Uh, you. Uh, this is some person's home that I've just intruded into. My mummy promised me that she'd make us curry tomorrow. I'm excited. You're lying, aren't you? My child nagged me into preparing curry, so I promised him I would. But... Finish your sentence! Oh my god, it's so... Oh, so much suspense. Oh god. I'm gonna be wondering what the hell she was gonna say now. As soon as I've looked through her entire kitchen. And ideally stolen some curry. Uh... Damn me in my not curry stealing ways. It's nice that you can run inside. It's a nice change from Pokemon. Uh, oh, old man. You know we have wonderful tales. Have you seen a cat around? I'm looking for one for my dear little granddaughter. Um, I take back what I said about interesting tales. Uh, <laughs> okay, right. Um, there's a shop there. Maybe that's. It's it's gone from searching for a shop to intriguing to people's houses, and I don't like it. Right. Welcome to my shop. Um, do you have any iron ore here? Oh, I'm sorry, we just sold out of it. Really? See that girl over there? I sold her all we had. She's in the competition, isn't she? What? I'm afraid not. I didn't... Okay. What are we going to do now? We don't have enough to buy anything with the money we have now. Could he? Eh, uh -uh, it's alright, I guess. What's the matter with the girl? Oh! You're thinking we should steal it from her and kill it. I mean, buy some from her. Hmm, what should I do? Uh, <laughs> I, yeah, why not? Uh, well then, let's just ask her. Um, hey there, beautiful. <laughs> Come here often? Yeah. I mean, hi there. I'm wondering if you wouldn't mind selling us some iron ore? What's this all of a sudden? You! Have I met you somewhere before? Ah! I remember you now. You were there at the opening ceremony. So you're participating in the tournament too? It appears so. Hmm. I was just surprised that someone as spaced out as you had the guts to enter the tournament. But what's that supposed to mean? Just as I said. And I'm not going to sell you my iron ore. Your fault, slope. Oh my god, we've got our father's genes! We are a we're a Pokemon! <laughs> ah. I, I don't have time to mess with you. I'm going to the labyrinth now. See you! Seriously, just mug her. It's sick, sick, sick cutie on him. Sick bob on him. Yeah. <laughs> Great. What should I do now? So. Anyway, let's go talk with the master about this. Cutie. 
I will get more kawaii. <laughs> I'll try to at least. Ooh, wow, that is it's quite a fast run, actually. I'm impressed. Um, to the stairs. Of course, of course, running inside is quite dangerous, and I don't know why I thought my ma the master would be in my bedroom. It's a bit worrying that I thought the master would be in my bedroom. Uh, you. Hey, you're back. Did you get the materials? Actually... What? They were completely sold out to a mean girl? That's correct. She said, I can't believe that someone as spaced out as you could enter the tournament. Or something like that. I see. That's gotta be Sanary. Sa okay. Sanary? Aye, she's one of my apprentices here at the Silver Guild. She's a bitch and is competing in the tournament. She's a contestant, yeah. She's a contestant just like you. I told her about the sales as well. You... What? Oh, I don't like you anymore. How come... What did you expect? You aren't the only trainee here. I gotta be fair, you know. You're right. Anyway, Sanary tends to be tough on others. So I can imagine that she picked on you too. You don't seem upset about it. But don't you think that she could have sold at least one of her, her oars? Mm -hmm. Nah, what Sanary did was correct. You two are rivals now. The battle's already begun, in and out of this arena. <sighs> yes. Well, there's no use worrying about that now. You're gonna have to find your own materials in the labyrinth. Huh? Well, wait a second. You told us that it's too dangerous to go there without any weapons. Can we at least borrow a- Shut your trap! If you want to be a craft lord, never ever say you're gonna borrow a weapon that someone else made to go hunting for materials. Uh Besides, you already have the mightiest craft knight weapon of all. Is it... is it my spirit? Huh? Your hammer, of course. <laughs> the hammer is my penis. <laughs> that, that wasn't me being weird. It's a reference to, um, Dr. Horrible Single Unplug. I felt I should clarify that one. <laughs> Otherwise, I, I run the risk of being misconstrued. But this this is just a hammer we use for crafting. <laughs> and now I'm gonna I'm just gonna think of that. Wonderful. Now listen carefully. The hammer can forge not only a weapon, but also a man. <laughs> oh my god. Oh I don't like the creepy grin when he said a man so, especially in context of everything else we've been talking about, uh, huh? <laughs> Isn't that right, Bob Rebo? <laughs> cool, it is. Mm. Mm. All right, you all understand. Now get going. What? Hammer is now usable. Oh, because I couldn't use it before, right? Press the A button to use the hammer. Gotcha. Can I? Uh! Okay, I won't hammer him. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that emo motion. Right. We bring it down so hard that our legs just have to swing apart. Because that's realistic. <laughs> uh, anyway, to the dungeon to probably kill some rats or something. Well, the guard's not here anymore, but... Hey there, you must be a craft knight. Is there something you'd like to know about combat? Um, now I'll learn it as I go, it's alright, I'm, <laughs> I'm a quick learner. <laughs> um, hey, I have a key. Why did I need a key if the door is open, you're just standing in front of it? Do I have to like, shove it in your mouth? Uh, <laughs> looks like you have the key alright, but why don't you have any weapons? The labyrinth is way too dangerous, I can't let you go down there unarmed, even if you are a craft lord candidate escorted by a guardian beast. That was a long sentence. Come back after you've properly equipped. I have a weapon. Where? This hammer? That's a smithy hammer, isn't it? You need to take care of your tools as a craft knight. Weapons aren't the only things that this... Yeah, weapons aren't the only things that this hammer can forge. It can forge a man! Um, did, did that work? You've got guts, kid. Those are bold... <laughs> You're kidding me. Uh, well said. <laughs> if you're that willing to go, I've got no right to stop you. I'm going to die down there, and it's your fault. 
Go show us how far you can go with just a hammer in hand. Probably five steps before in before death. Don't worry, if something happens, we'll tell your folks how brave you are. Oh, that's reassuring, huh? Uh, uh, hmm. Huh? What's that strange looking panel there? It's glowing green. I get it! That must be the teleporter. But I don't think it's usable just yet. It's very observant. I I wouldn't be able to tell. Okay, ooh, a chest. Ooh, a bitch. I mean, a sanary. You don't get it, do you? I repeat, I won't give any of my iron ore to you. I never told you to give it to me. And my name is Butter. Well, okay. So, Butter, you're going to the labyrinth with just a hammer? Whose fault do you think this is? I couldn't make my weapon because I didn't have any iron. Oh boy, are you trying to tell me that all of this is my fault? Are you crazy? Crazy like a fox? <laughs> um, right. Uh, um, well, if, if you're that determined to get materials, I might help you. I'll give you a quiz, and if you answer correctly, I'll give you the materials that I found earlier. This is a situation that would never happen in real life. Like it's a video game, I suppose. Wait a second! Don't just make things up. Now, now, you don't have to thank me yet. Here's the first question. A female craft knight is greater than a male one. True or false? Um, in the hopes of getting into your pants. No, I'm kidding, of course, but she probably wants to hear true. A female one is... A uh, female one is greater. <laughs> Saying that in a female voice probably didn't help the matters. Correct! Correct! Ah, oh, voices. Now here's the second question. A female craft like craft that craft knight looks cooler than a male one. True or false? Well, I look like a dopey idiot, so. But I'm also all for equality, so screw you. Wait a second. Gender doesn't matter, does it? You call this a quiz? Wrong. A female one looks cooler, of course. Didn't you know that? Hmm. Game over. No presents for the loser. See ya. I didn't want your presents. Cool. Sanary is such a meanie that <laughs> complaining about her won't help. Let's just forget it and move on. Cooty! Oh god, I keep I keep trying to go with Kawaii. <laughs> but it always comes out kind of creepy. Oh. Okay. Oh, what? Oh my god, what? This is new. Um. I'm. I'm a 2D sprite and I got a hammer. Ah, you bitch. Okay. So. What? Um. What? What? <laughs> Epic combat right here, guys. Oh, proud of myself. So, and suddenly I've got a sword, but ignore that. It's actually a hammer. I'm an idiot. <laughs> you think you could smash the crystals for, all, for like, materials, but... And there's another thing! Uh, what? Oh, I can guard. Can I... Oh, I can switch weapons. Guard is B, apparently. Okay. Ow! I don't have much health. It's, well, I've got... Eh, that did do quite a bit of damage, strangely. Just spam A, and we're fine, I guess. And we've got more experience and a tiny bit of money. Um, oh! How do I use Bob? Probably should have spoke to that guy, shouldn't I? Uh, yeah, doesn't matter. Um, hmm, let's see if we can figure this out. Hey. Oh, dude! Fight me! Come on! You think you're hard enough? Attack me! Come on then! Right, that still did me damage, but it was much. Ow! That dude's fast. Okay. I know not to underestimate my opponent now. <laughs> oh. Woo! -hoo! Level up! But level up! Bob Ribbon, level up! Allocate a. Okay. Um. What? Uh. <laughs> um. <laughs> Okay, yes, a, a, um, agility probably needs a point. How do I... There you go. Cool. I'm cool with that. <laughs> that was... That was odd. Right. Uh, ah. Huh? Sanary? Cool. She seems a bit different, though. A, a little more gentle. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Who's there? Oh, I'm sorry. 
Oh, fishies! Ow! Oh. I mean, I didn't mean to disturb you or anything. I don't mind. This place isn't mine, so I won't tell you to leave. Really? <laughs> Thanks. Oh, look how beautiful this place is. I can see straight into the ocean. How pretty. It's like an undersea observatory. Hmm. My sister took me to this place a few years ago. I always wanted to come back here again. I wanted to make it here without my sister's help. That's why this place is special to me. Every time I come here, I can feel that I'm getting closer to her. You love your sister, don't you? I do. Well, I've chatted long enough. I should get going. See ya! Oh my god, character development. Oh, she doesn't sound that bad. Cootie? Yeah, uh, <laughs> don't answer his question. I and all. Yeah, screw you, Sanary. Screw you, Slime. There's two. Oh my god. Oh, I'm, I'm screwed. But we've leveled up, so we've got power now. We also need to heal. Um, okay, just hit with a hammer. Can we hit both at once? Oh, yes, we can. Ow. I should block more. Yeah. Come on, come on then. Okay. Fine, be that one. Come on, I know you're doing it. There we go. Good. How do we heal? I really don't understand how we heal. Do we just... We'll probably have to find an item or something. That should be enough materials for now. Maybe I should go back and start making my weapon. Cool. Cool, we are, we'll actually get a sword! Like we have in the ending scene. <laughs> Is there... Okay, no. Pause just shows you the, um... What's around. Uh... Okay. Yep. Good. Come on! Oh, spam it! Oh, bash it, skull in! Oh, ooh, there we go. It's, it feels strangely violent to bash in a slime's skull. Doesn't, what would? Wait, I can. Can I do a jump in it? Oh, it's not as spectacular as I thought it'd be. Does did that do more damage? No, it didn't. It was just a random amount of damage. Of course, and it was only a move that took slightly more skill than slamming the A button. There's no reason for it to do more damage. <laughs> right. Oh, forget, forget. We can run. Oh, damn it. Okay, okay. This will be a little bit more exciting when we get better weapons, I do hope. But the story is impressing me. Oh, come on. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. Wonderful. Wonderful. Alright, teleport's still not working, I suppose. So, yeah. Fair suitably impressed that I got this far with a hammer. And, um, and I'm accidentally on my scooter. So... <laughs> Right, back to the workshop. We had a bit of character development with Selene, person, meanie, woman. Yo, what's up? You got something you want to ask? Um, no. no. Alright, I guess I, he doesn't, we don't need to, like, tell him that we've got the ore, we just go to our smelter thing and hit it with a hammer. <laughs> weapon. I have no weapons. Item. Oh, oh bandages recover HP, okay. 150. Wow, that's more than our life bar. Cool. Uh, how many? Iron ore. Yes. What did we do with that weapon? What did we just do with? Okay. New tech. Yes. Right. Go on, Cootie. Just kick the the flaming iron sword. Is that the novice knife? Cool. It's finished. Cootie. Oh God. That just sounds creepy. Hey! So you got so you so you completed your first piece, master. Let me take a look. All right, not bad. I guess this will pass. Bob Raybon did almost all the work for you. He kicked the, the metal. Further. That's true. No, no, it's not. I'm, but I'm so happy. I, I complete my very first weapon. Always rem always remember that feeling, Butter. <laughs> that satisfaction you have now will push you to make better, finer pieces. Keep at it. Yes, Master. Right. Oh. Oh, look who it is. Uh, well, well. I should have known it was Butter making all the ruckus around here. Why does she hate me? I've done nothing. What? It took you all this time to make your first weapon? Ah! <laughs> Well, excuse me. 
There's nothing, there's nothing wrong, but... You're such a slowpoke. I know, I'll evolve soon. Then my agility will still be terrible. But at least, I mean, Slow King probably has decent speed. It's better than Slowpoke. Anyway, I'm, I'm, I digress. You think you can win with that kind of pace? Mmm! <laughs> Gotta help you too. Yes, Master. I guess that was unla unladylike of me. Butter is a bad influence. Me? Hey, Yoto. Oh, when I say stop, stop! Yes, yes, sir. Hello? Hello? I'm sorry to bother you, but... What do you want? I'm, I'm here to deliver the notice for Butter's first round in the tournament. Oh, no. Ah, oh, what did I do? Well, don't just stand there. Hurry up and take it. Yes, here you are. Mm -hmm. Match. Oh, no. Even if the first round is chaves from the gold guild. Oh, that's right. He's very malleable metal. You can reach the battle arena from the first floor of the central tower. Speak to the official at the end of the hallway and he'll guide you to the tournament arena. Nope, oh, there is something else you need to remember. Only one weapon is allowed to be used in the tournament. Therefore, please come equipped with your favourite weapon. Good luck. Hmm. Chase, eh? That was a bit manly. Well, good luck and do your best. <laughs> um, wh what is Chaves like? <clears throat> He's not that strong of an opponent, but with the weapon you have now, it'll be tough. Do you think so? Cool. I see. All right, I'll teach you one more technique. Really? Oh, you're mighty fat and generous today, Mark. What? Do you... You've got one hell of a ghetto booty, Master. <laughs> what did you say? I said you're really generous today. <laughs> Cootie! Uh, it flattens out at the end, that's one. Ooh! Uh... <laughs> oh, so many choices. What, what, what can I go with? Um... Hmm... Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let's try Spear. So I, like, I like Reach, you know? And if not, we can just change at the end anyway. We'll do something. We'll try a different weapon eventually, of course. When you're ready, head to the arena on the first floor of the Central Tower. Go show them what you're made of. Okay... Hmm. I'm getting a bit nervous now. Cooty! Bit, be bit better, yeah. Yeah, you're right. I'm counting on you, Bob Reborn. Cool. Uh, create weapons. Spear. Gonna make a spear. I don't have enough materials. Can I make any materials? Item. I cannot make. <laughs> Damn it. Um. Which material will you. Wait, so can I, like, hmm, okay, so I I think I just got rid of my weapon, but I should be able to now make a, s no, no, what do we need for spear, that's, I, we need nothing that it will tell us, what, um, uh, oops, <laughs> I, oh, don't tell me that I just did something very silly. <laughs> Mm, uh, I think I... <laughs> uh, um... <sighs> ah, well, guy... <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> in total, um, in total Barca theme, I've just destroyed the only weapon that I had. <sighs> Actually, before I, before I end, we've got like 30 seconds. Let's quickly... Oh, okay, let's do this then. Um, cutscene. Huh? What brings you here, Mum? I'm just checking to see how you're doing. Oh, it, it looks like you've decided on a partner. For life. Um... Cootie! Do you know him, Mum? Have you two met before? Of course I do. Bob Reborn used to be your father's guardian beast. Gucci, Gucci. You should pay respect when addressing his name. All right. With Bob Reborn at your side, you'll be just fine. Hang in there, Butter. Uh, sure. Look, I need to get to the to the, to the shop to hopefully get some more iron ore. So, 
god, I can't believe I was that stupid. I thought that I, it would just give me iron ore, and I could... Oh, bugger. And I could just use it in, um... I could just use it to craft the spear, but apparently not, so... <laughs> Damn. Um, let's just go drown off. Oh, our sorrows in the pub. Just sit in the corner. So, well, stand on a on a chair in the corner and cry. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very very much for watching. Next episode, we'll hopefully get a new weapon. For now, though, I guess we'll have we'll be forced to use a hammer. It could be better, but uh, that's life, I guess. Um, yeah. Aside from that. I guess this is where I should say Achoo! That was that was meant I was I had that in mind to be kawaii with that but adieu.